today we went on a little shopping spree it was unintentional but there's a really cool shop down here called vantage and it's like a curated thrift store vintage place and they're having a five dollar sale where everything is five dollars so as you can see we got lots of things and i am going to show you everything that i got right i didn't get you anything so sorry Starting off, I was thinking of things for summer because I just like wearing one layer. I don't want to wear tons of layers because I am a sweaty girl. So I got this short sleeve pink top. It's just a little button down. There is like super thin shoulder pads in it, which don't really make a difference. I'm not sure why they're in there, but super simple pink top. I think it'll be great with skirts, pants. Then we got this top. It has a little scenery of some buildings from I don't know where. It's a three-quarter sleeve top, so I guess it's not really summery, but I'll still wear it. Next up, I was actually thinking about this a couple days ago, how I have always wanted a Harley Davidson t-shirt, but I never see them at the thrift store and I don't have any connections to Harley Davidson because my family is anti-motorcycles. I think it's a really cool top. On the back it says Gator Harley Davidson and it was only five dollars. Oh and by the way I'm wearing this Bart Simpson one. That was my grandpa's I'm pretty sure. Next I was gonna say it is my first Carhartt item but I'm pretty sure I have a beanie. I have a couple beanies from Carhartt but I got these pants. They're a little big but I can just wear a belt and they have a patch that someone put on there but I don't mind. I think it looks good. It was really hard to dig in the pile and actually find pants that were small enough. There were like child pants which I was like maybe I can squeeze into them and then there were massively big ones that I was like if I alter them they're gonna look weird. So glad I found these ones. Then we have another shoulder padded item. This is a button up with some cheetahs on it. Kind of a funky top. I envisioned this one as a little night out on the town because we want to start doing date nights again. But I think it's pretty cute, pretty cool. I got another fleece zip up. I have a turquoise one that I've been wearing a lot, but this one is purple. And we did see a purple North Face one in their normal shop, but this one was only $5. So I just went with this one, but the North Face one was cool too. Okay, this item. This is a baseball cap that says Jesus on it. I don't know why, but people there were definitely clowning on it. And I was like, well, I actually like Jesus. So I think I should get this. I think it's very fitting. I don't like how rounded the cap is, but I think I can flatten it out. Next, there's just this dry pink and white button up. I could wear it in the summer, just like over tank tops. It's a light little piece. Then I have these slacks. They fit pretty well and they are just, I don't know what you call this. There's a name for this pattern. Do you know the name for this pattern, babe? Um, yeah, it sounds like wolf tape or saber something. Yeah, or like, yeah, something tooth. That sounds right. Anyway, thought these were cool trousers. You can dress them up, dress them down. Good to go. Then I got this yellow top. I really liked the collar on it. I'm still not sure how I feel about the yellow. I don't know if yellow is a good color on me, but it has really big shoulder pads and I thought it would be cute for summer, really bright. Next up, this is a stereotypical 2000s top. I did have a hot pink one that I ended up selling on my Depop, which if you wanna look at it, I will link that down below. But I thought this was a cuter color and it's kind of a different shape. It'll be cute tucked into jeans with like a belt. So we'll see if I get some use out of this. If not, I will post all of these on my Depop if I wanna sell them. So you guys should go check that out. Next, we have this little frilly top. It's long sleeve with some frilly little, what are these called, arms, yes. And I thought this would be cute for a little fancier, maybe like date night or church outfit, something. We'll see what I can do with it. Lots of button downs today, but there's another one. This does have shoulder pads. It's just kind of an oversized checkered pattern. Have this t-shirt. It says the original founding fathers, which I don't know how you feel about that. I don't know how I feel about that, honestly, but it is what it is. It's a cool t-shirt. And I got this little purse. 
I have just been using my crochet purse. I just usually get fixated on one purse for a while, but maybe I will switch out my crochet purse and start using this one. I thought it was a really cute color and it's pretty big so I could fit a lot of things in there. It is genuine leather, it says, from Flora's Bags, if you wanted to look up that brand. And I saved the last two items, which in my opinion are the best. So we saved the best for last. I got some overalls. These were not in the $5 pile, but they were in the store and I love overalls and I will be wearing them a lot this summer. So I got another jean pair. They have these buttons on the front and then they're more of a straight leg on the bottom. One of my favorite overalls that I wear are also from here, but they give me a wedgie, so hopefully these ones don't. And then I got a black corduroy pair of overalls, which the guy said that that is like really rare that they have them in their store and they're hard to find. So I'm glad I snagged these. They're really lightweight. I'll definitely be wearing these this summer too. Those are all of the items I got and the way that I styled them. Make sure if you want to check out my Depop, you can look down below at the handle. Yeah, hope you guys liked this video and I'll talk to you later. Bye!